playing more, uh, what are the controls again? Oh yeah, the controls are weird. Okay, back playing more Undertale. Okay, so we're at Toriel's house. Surprise, it's a butterscotch cinnamon pie, let's go. I want you to have a nice time living here. Thank you, Toriel. Thank you very much. Have another surprise. Another surprise. Oh yeah. Uh, room. Heck yeah. I'll take the room. Is something burning? You make yourself at home. I'm. This home isn't going to be here any longer if something's burning. Holy frick. Uh, uh, a box of kid shoes and disparity of sizes. Toriel murders kids. <laughs> uh, what's this? Look at those cool toys. They don't interest you at all. Oh, oh, that's sad. A box of kids. Oh, okay, I already looked at the creepy box. Oh, okay, lights off. Bedtime. Let's go sleep. Okay. Heck yeah, the pie. You found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Let's go. What's down here? I forgot. Mirror? I cannot see myself in the mirror, for I am too short. I can see myself in this one. Heck yeah. What's in here? Oh, I'm hitting the wrong button. Room under renovations. Okay, okay. How about here? Uh, this is Toriel's room, right? It's Toriel's diary. Read the circled passage. Heck yeah. You read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling bonely. I hate this already. <laughs> it's an encyclopedia of the... Okay. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna get on with the game. No need to... Oh, wait. Heck. Okay, I'm back in the dialogue. No. I need to get on with the game. I need to stop looking at everything. Okay. Okay. Hello. I would not uh, recommend putting your hand in that fire. All right. Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know I'm glad to have someone here. I'm not. There are so many old books I want to share. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. Okay, that sounds interesting. I've also prepared a, a circulum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I have always wanted to be a teacher. Really? I'm not sure how you'd be that of a teacher, like underground or something. Still, I'm glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? Uh, when can I go home? This is your home now? That's kind of creepy, Toriel. I don't know about that one. Um, would you like to hear about a book I am reading? It is called 72 Uses for Snails. Yeah, well, I know 73 uses, so take that. How about it? Sure. Here's an exciting snail fact. Did you know snails, sometimes they flip their digestive systems as they mature? Excuse me, what? I do that too. Uh, how to exit the ruins. I have, some, I have something to do, stay here. I will not stay here, in fact, I will go in the kitchen. Don't tell me what to do. The size of the pie intimidates you too much to eat it. Yeah, okay, fair enough. Pie does scare me sometimes. Okay, so we're coming up on our first boss in the game. It's right up here. Hello, Toriel. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. That's kinda creepy. Now be a good child and go upstairs. Don't tell me what to do. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I've seen it again and again. They come, they leave. They die. Well, that's really unfortunate. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. Yeah, well, it happens, you know. 
I'm the only one protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. Don't tell me what to do. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. What are you going to do? Count to three? Oh, Frey. You want to leave so badly. Hmm. You are just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you're strong enough to survive. And here it is, the first boss of the game. I don't remember this fight too much. Tutorial, uh, talk. You couldn't think of conversation topics. That's not good. Okay. Okay. Okay, I think I just thought of a, com a topic, uh... Topic of not to kill me, please. Spare? Okay. <laughs> I don't want to kill Toriel. Okay. Okay. Uh, do I have to fight her? Yeah, because I can't talk. Hmm. Uh, talk? Oh no. I don't want to fight her, I don't want to kill Toriel. Oh jeez. Do I have to fight her? I don't remember what to do here. I don't want to kill you. Okay. Oh, she, she's, she doesn't want to fight me. Okay, yeah, I remember this. Once you get to low enough health, she just, she just stops trying to kill you. Why won't you attack me? Fight me. What, what are you doing? We, we, hit me. So I guess this isn't really a boss fight because you, she just doesn't kill you. Yeah, this isn't really a boss fight now, is it? Pearl takes a deep breath. Spare. Fight or leave. Why would I leave? There's nowhere for me to go. I don't want to be in your home. Stop it? No. Don't tell me what to do. Why? Listen, I'm trying not to kill you here, lady. Go away. You want me to stay, though, so how is that? It's like, this lady right here. Come on. Do it, hit me. I know you want to go home, but... Spare. But please, go upstairs now. Spare. I promise I'll take good care of you here. Spare. <laughs> I will not stop this, Toriel. You cannot stop me. My will is stronger than yours. Why are you making this so difficult? I have absolutely no idea. Please, go upstairs. No. Don't tell me what to do. Haha. Uh -huh. This isn't funny. Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. Uh, that's kind of sad. No, I understand. You will just be unhappy trapped down here. The rooms are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. Oh, well, this just turned sad. For you, my child, I'll put them aside. Alright. Bam. First boss done without stabbing. Epic. I will not stop you, however, when you leave. Please do not come back. I hope you understand. Aw, hug. Now please, let me go. I don't want to be here anymore. Goodbye, my child. You knew me for like an hour, what do you mean? Actually 38 minutes, but... <laughs> yeah. Alright. Why is the floor a different color from... Where it was? Yep, no, it's getting lighter. Floor just gets lighter and lighter. Oh, there's Flowey. How's it going, my guy? Clever, very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's killer be killed. So were you able to? So were 
So you were able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. He he he. Is he what is he, Michael Jackson? He he. I bet you feel really great. I, I do, I do. You didn't kill anybody this time. What do you mean by this time? What's that supposed to mean? But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? That's a good question. You'll die and you'll die and you'll... No, that's kind of messed up. Until you're tight. Until you tire of try... Tire? This guy's illiterate. What will you do then? Will you... Will you kill out of frustration? Perhaps. Or will you give up entirely on this world? This guy's kind of messed up. <laughs> Let me inherit the power and control. I am the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my... My little monarch plan... Okay, can you shut up, Flowey? I really... This little guy right here. This guy. Get out of my game, Flowey. Holy frick. Bam, took me like 40 minutes to get through to the intro of the game. <laughs> By Toby Fox, nice. Okay, let me play. Come on. Enter. Alright. Now is when the game really begins, I'd say. Branch. Whoop, it's broken. That's not good. <gasps> There's somebody following me. Bridge. Uh oh. Who could that be? Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? No, no, I don't. Turn around. You're kind of, you're kind of scaring me. Turn around, shake my hand. That, that's kind of threatening. Don't tell me what to do. That was the funniest thing I've ever heard. He he he! The old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. Yeah, I've tried that a few times. It's always funny, is it? Anyways, you're a human, right? That's that's hilarious. What is that supposed to mean? I'm Sans, Sans the Skeleton, yes. I love this guy. This guy's my favorite. I'm actually so pooped to be on watch for humans right now, but, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. My brother, Papyrus, he, he's a human hunting fanatic. Uh, pretty... No, not, I don't, I, I can make a joke about that, but I'm not going to. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars too wide to stop anyone. Whoa. The intelligence of this guy is over 9,000. Quick, behind that conven conveniently shaped lamp. Amazing. You know, you, you guys can read this part right now. I, I, I can't I can't read the, all of this. Holy crap. <laughs> you know what's up, brother? Uh, I'm probably gonna end up reading it out loud anyways. Uh, but my voice is boring. I'll just I'll just I'll just go through. I'll let you guys read. The 
this guy's hilarious. Oh. Put a little bit more backbone into it. Uh -huh. Okay, that one was that that one wasn't very bad. That was that one was actually pretty good. Hey. Okay. Oh, okay, you came back for one last lap. Okay, you can come out now. I'm not sure if I want to. That was the worst thing I've ever heard in my entire life. You ought to get going. He might come back in if he does. You'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. Okay. I, I will be actually. Hey, hate to bother you, but can you do me a favor? Favor. I'm having a stroke. I was I was thinking that my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you just might make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million, I'll be up ahead. Alrighty then. So, we just met Sans and Papyrus. They're interesting characters. That's for sure. What's up here? <laughs> fishing pole? It's a fishing rod fixed to the ground. Reel it in? Yeah. All that's attached to the end is a photo of a weird looking monster. Call me, here's my number. You decide not to call. I, I want to call him. How do I do that? Uh, Cell. No, I want to call, I, I want to call the monster. Dial it. Uh, whoops, I call Toriel. Yeah, okay, I apologize, Toriel. Uh, what is this? Use the box, yes. Uh, there's a tough glove. I kind of want that. Uh, I'm gonna put the spider donuts in there. Uh, toy knife, maybe. And not. Tough glove. I'll, I will have the tough glove. How do I exit the uh, shift? Okay. I am no longer. Uh. 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 Okay. So, as I was saying about Undyne. <sighs> Smike. <Mike? laughs> oh, jeez, they spinning. A <laughs> loady spinning. <laughs> Sans, oh my. <laughs> Is that a human? Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's a rock, too. Dwayne the Rock Johnson. Hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my... Is that a human? Yes. Oh my... Sans, I finally did it on time. Well, I'm gonna... I'll be so popular, popular, popular... Really? I'm having a stroke. Ahem, human. You shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. Have fun trying, my guy. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Don't tell me what to do. Then, then. I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue only if you dare. Ni hee hee. Well, that one, yeah, I, I'd say so. I didn't die, so yeah, that's pretty good. That's what it kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. Jeez. These skeleton jokes are gonna break my back. Hey, uh, check. There's no Drake attacked. Well, okay, so, oh, yeah, not a fan of, what the, f not a fan. Smells like a wet pillow. Okay, I cannot, oh wait, I, I can just flee? I didn't know that was an option. You observe the well-crafted sentry station. Do I? I bet it was very, okay. Sign? Absolutely no moving. Don't tell me what to. Oh. I've made a mistake. I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never. Oh, alright. Doggo. Don't move an inch. Okay. Doggo can't seem to find- yeah, it's because I'm staying still. Pet? You pet Doggo? Yes, I do pet Doggo. Well, I've been pet. Pet, 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 pet. I don't know. 
Oh, oh, oh wait, no, I accidentally checked him. I wanted to pet him again. I want to pet. What happens if I keep doing it? Where's that coming from? I'm, like, I'm just going to keep on doing it. amused by the pets. Okay, that's enough. I'm gonna keep doing it. How long can I do this for? Okay, that's enough. Okay, yeah, I think this might be enough. I've been doing this for a few minutes now. Spare. You won 30 gold? Something pet me, something that isn't moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this, yeah. Yeah, probably. Oh, hey, Sans. How's it going, my guy? Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Yeah, I assume so. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. Well, when you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so imagine having a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think of a blue, blue stop sign. So why is that yellow, then? I want to read that sign. I don't read that sign, nothing's gonna stop me from reading the sign. Okay, maybe a few things, okay. Okay, so just a lot of ice and snowed in. What's up here? Hey, it's a snowman. Hello, I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you would be so kind, traveler, please take a piece of me and bring it very far away. Sure. Thank you, good luck. You got the snowman piece, all right. Well, I guess I got a little snowman friend now. That's pretty epic. I've always wanted one of those. Oh frick. What the frick? Uh... Compliment? The inform Ice Cat that he has a great hat. My hat's too loud for me to hear you. What? Oh! Oh! Okay. Okay. Uh, comp? I, I will keep doing that. My hat's too- okay, so he's not gonna be able to hear me, because his hat's just out to the easiest attack to dodge. Hmm. What if I ignore? You managed to tear your eyes away from Ice Cap's hat. He- it looks annoyed. Hello, my hat's up here. Uh-oh. Okay. Ice Cap is secretly- <laughs> Ignore. You continue not looking at Ice Cap's hat. It seems defeated. Better. <laughs> oh yeah, no, this attack can just stand still. Ice Cap is desperate for attention. Uh, shit. All right, get out of here. You can go have fun with your hat, my guy. I. Oh frick. You're so lazy. You were napping all night. I think that's called sleeping. Whoa. Excuses. Oh no, the human arrives in order to stop you. My brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. No pun intended. For you see this, the visible light. Yeah, okay, I'm, I'm not gonna read all this out loud, it's annoying. It's only like fun because the amount of fun you will be probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go on ahead now. Why did he get shocked? What did you do? I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. This guy's an idiot. Hold this, please. Oh, just eats up into the air. Okay, now try. <laughs> Incredible, you slippery snail. You solved it so easily, too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It's designed by my brother Sam, so it will surely be... Yep. I know I am. Hehehe. <laughs> Anyways, uh... Hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he was wearing? He made it a few weeks ago for his costume party. He hasn't worn anything ever since. He keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? Yeah, he's, he's so cool. He's the coolest guy I ever met. I don't understand why these ice creams aren't selling. It's perfect weather for something cold. Oh, a customer. 
Hello, would you like some ice cream? It's a frozen treat that warms your heart. Heck yeah, I'll have some ice cream. Here you go. Thank you, mister. I have ice cream now. It's more ice cream than you have. Okay. What is this? Oh yeah, it's another puzzle. Okay. So I'm pretty sure I got to get it down into that hole. Okay, oh, but it melts. Okay. Got to get it down there before it melts. That's going to be a little bit difficult. Oh no. Stop. I swear, oh my gosh, this is going to... Okay. 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 No, no, I swear. I swear. Okay. Yes! First try. No, second try. Purple, even when you fell trapped, you took notes and achieved the end of the ball. You were awarded two, two gold. Okay, did that do anything for me, though? I, there's... I don't think that did any... Human, I hope you were ready for it. Sans, where's the puzzle? It's right here, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can get past this one. <laughs> oh jeez, no, I'm gonna be stuck here for so long, why would you do this to me? Sans, that didn't do anything. Whoops. I know, I should've used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble's easily the hardest. What? Really? Dude, that's pretty easy. Okay. Unbelievable. <laughs> Can't wait until I get a fight Papyrus, uh, which is harder. I find Jumble a lot harder than Cross, but I'm gonna go with Jumble. Ha <laughs> ha. Yes. Humans must be very intelligent. They also find Junior Jumble so difficult. <laughs> Alrighty then. That was, that was interesting, that was certainly an experience. Oh. Alright, uh, I think that's where I'm going to end this video for today, so uh, goodbye everybody and have a great day. Uh, see you later.